Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. To myself. What a wonderful So today's video is going to be an update to my project wax. So this is an update slash kind of like the spring introduction of my project wax. So I have this going pretty much year round and I change it up seasonally, but honestly, I'm just trying to finish up candles and sometimes I do candles that are not in the correct season. Like I have a few fall candles still going from like September, October of last year into now. And by the way, if you hear <laughs> like munching, Kai is sitting right here on the bed. But um, yeah, so this is basically just a project where I'm trying to use up candles and um, I have a lot to update you guys on because I kind of forgot to post an update to this um, for March. So this is the update for March. Sorry about that. Um, but this is also just kind of like the spring introduction. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to do this a little bit differently than I usually do. Um, I'm actually going to show you guys the candles that I finished and show you what's going to replace them in the project. And then I'm going to show you the candles that I still have in the project and show you the progress. And so yeah, that's how we're going to do it. Also, sorry if you can hear the lawnmower guys outside. There are a few houses down, but this is the only time I could film today, so please bear with me. Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and start with the first empty, and that is Pumpkin Bonfire. I actually finished this off at the end of February. And it's a great scent. It was kind of like smoky at the end, which of course it's a bonfire scent. It's going to be smoky, but I really enjoyed this. If they come out with it again in the fall, I will definitely get it. But like this packaging is stunning. I love it so much. I think I might keep this one and keep the packaging for like fall time and like put bobby pins in it or something. So we'll see. And then the one that's going to replace it is a brand new candle to me. I just got it. Positively Sweet Dark Chocolate Truffles. This is actually from the uh, Valentine's Day collection. And I just got it at the, what was it, 12.35, 12.95 candle sale or 10.35? I don't know what it was. But the candle sale that just happened and I got this candle. Scent notes are rich chocolate, gooey butterscotch, and candy cherry. It smells amazing. And I've been dying for some sort of chocolate scent. So I think this one will be great. And I'm not quite sure if I'm gonna do this one like downstairs or in my bedroom, but this one's really nice and look how pretty it is. I'm to mark this one and it is unused. So I'm just gonna mark it, it's at the very top, um, but I will keep track of my progress on that one. The next candle that I finished is Peppermint Sugar Cookie. I also finished this in February. It was so, so, so good. This scent honestly is amazing, especially for the time of year when I used it. I might pick up like two now going forward in the winter time because this is really good for of course december but i loved it in february because it was still kind of cold here and every time we got a cold snap i would pull this thing out and it was delicious in my living room oh my god it was so good so i loved this one i'm gonna pick up two next year it was so good and to replace that one i'm gonna do coconut cream pie this one's also from that valentine's day collection um, this is actually an online exclusive that I got a few weeks back on a different candle sale. The scent notes are toasted coconut flakes, caramel custard, and golden pie crust. I've been craving this one in body care, and I think I only have a spray left in it, but I would love to have the like body lotion, body cream, because it's so yummy, and the shower gel, oh, it's so yummy. And it makes me think of fall, not fall, <laughs> it makes me think of summer with like that coconut. Oh, it smells so good. So really excited to bring this one out. I cannot wait to start burning it. Another one that I finished is Love Cotton Candy Champagne. And I actually finished this one maybe a week or two ago. So fairly recently, the scent notes are Bubbly Rosé, Sweet Strawberry, and Pink Sugar. This one was a great one downstairs in the living room as well. It's just like a fruity scent. I really like like a fruity scent every now and then, um, like during a work day. It just makes, it kind of like lifts me up. So this one was really good and finished that off. So replacing it, I'm gonna go in with another fruity scent and that is a blackberry creme frosting. And the scent notes are fresh blackberries, sweet vanilla topped with bubbly Prosecco. It smells really yummy. I've already been burning this in my bedroom. It's already halfway done. So I figured I'd put it in the project because it's so close, but I marked it, it is right here. So yeah, I'm already halfway there. I've been loving this actually in the bedroom because it has like a slight sweet bakery to that fruitiness. And so it's been really yummy in the bedroom. 
And then one that I didn't put in the project, but I'm literally this close to finishing it, champagne toast. So I did not expect that, but I put it downstairs in the kitchen just thinking like, oh, we'll just use it every now and then when we cook and it smells weird. Well, I'm like literally almost done with it. So I'm gonna mark it right here and consider it to be done in like the next week or so because see, we're already down here. I'll probably get, you know, four more burns out of it or something, but oh God, it's so good. Especially right after you cook something and it's like really onion heavy or garlic heavy. This is so good. I'm dead. I love it so much. And then to replace it when it does dud out and finish, I'm gonna put in strawberry pound cake because I've been craving this so much. I've actually been craving it in the body care. So I think I'm gonna put it in um, for the spring project, use it up for body care, but I'm, I'm like really craving this in candle form. It is fresh picked strawberries, golden shortcake and whipped cream. It just smells amazing. It's unused. I got this at candle day actually, because I knew I'd use it throughout the year. So I'm going to mark it at the top cause it is unused. And I am very excited to put this one in because I've just been craving it so much. Okay. Some ones that I actually didn't burn at all. Um, this one is Hello Gorgeous Pumpkin Spice Latte. I just haven't had a use for a single wick coffee candle. If I burn a coffee candle, it's going to be this one downstairs, which it's still a little warm. So let me come be careful bringing it over here. But, um, I've actually been using this one whipped coffee, which is also in the project. And actually I think it's a little cool now. Yeah. It's still like kind of liquidy, but, um, I've gone from here to here. I've been obsessed with this lately doing it in the mornings i work from home most days um one day a week i'll go in the office but doing this one in the mornings with pumpkin donut shop which i'll show you that one's a little melted still too doing this in the mornings for work i've gotten a lot of use out of it it is just so nice so if i'm gonna do a coffee candle it's gonna be a three wick because i'm gonna do it in the living room i work in like kind of the dining room area um but I like it to be able to fill the room. So that one's really good. I don't think this one would fill the room. So I haven't used it at all. Um, I'm gonna try to start using it on like Saturdays and Sundays in the bedroom. Cause I feel like it'd be really good then if we're just like chilling in here, but we don't chill in here. We chill in the living room. So like, I don't know. So I'm gonna keep it in, but I haven't made any progress on it. So that that's that one. And then red velvet cupcake, I also have not made any progress on. I kind of forgot about it. I haven't burned it at all. Like it's unburned. I mean, it smells great. Don't get me wrong. It smells like cream cheese. I might save this one for fall, you guys. Because right now it's giving me like sweet carrot cake vibes. And I'm going to have to save it for fall. Lush red velvet cake, cream cheese frosting, sweet vanilla. It's smelling really cinnamon heavy to me, to my nose right now. And kind of giving me the eggs. Yeah, I'm going to take this out of the project. <laughs> okay. Sorry, red velvet cupcake. You're going out. Okay. And for single wicks, I did finish off raspberries and vanilla actually this month, the month of March. And this is the progress I made from here to here. So I did a lot of progress on it. Um, I, m not melted, I burned this one in the bathroom. And it was really nice to have something like fresh and fruity to like shower with or get up in the morning. It was really nice. And then to replace it, I'm gonna put in Stress Relief Aromatherapy. This is a great one also for the bathroom um, for when I'm doing like my self-care nights. Um, or I just want to like relax at night. So this is a great one. It's unused. I just got it, um, actually as a free gift with my, like with the Bath and Body Works reward program, I just got it as a free gift. So excited to use this one and yeah, I love it. It's a really good one. It's super strong too. Um, another update I have for you guys is pumpkin donut shop. This one is from 2020 and I'm obsessed. It is so yummy. It's honestly just powdered sugar donuts, but here's the progress from here to here. So it's pretty much almost done. Um, I burn this one primarily with the coffee sand, the coffee candle. So it's like coffee and donuts. It smells delicious that way. So I've been loving this and it's probably going to be finished by the next update. Another one I have some progress on is Give Love Peppermint Marshmallow. This is one of my favorite soft and gentle kind of candles. Um, I haven't gotten too much progress on it just from here to here, but it is such a sweet, nice, relaxing marshmallow. Honestly, there's not that much peppermint to it. It's just like a very simple, sweet marshmallow scent. And it's very light as well. I think I might actually finish this one up on the candle. I mean, on the candle crock that I have, which is actually just up there on the other side of this dresser. 
um because you can't really smell it too much and i'm almost done i mean like i'm more than halfway done with it i just like forget to burn it at night so i might finish it on the candle crock we'll see but i'm gonna aim to have this finished up by the next update and the last thing i have some progress on which is actually really great is pumpkin pie from goose creek this one i got a lot of progress on the last um since the last update and i think if i keep going at this rate i'll finish it off um, before the next update next month so that's great um this one has been a long time coming it looks like i've used one two oh it's only been one two three months actually one two three months so at the rate that's out i definitely could have used this in the fall i just didn't um but it's a great scent yeah it is a little pumpkin-y and it does soot but i use this in the living room and it's really great it just fill, fills the room with kind of this like maple syrupy crust brown sugar note, um, which is really nice. It does have like a bit of a pumpkin twinge to it, but it doesn't really bother me in the time being. So I'm just going to focus on finishing this one in the next month also. So yeah, that is everything for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. That was a lot of updates on candles. So I hope you guys like that. Let me know down below what candles you are loving burning right now. We're kind of in the transition to spring. I know some people are getting snow still and some people are already up to like the 80s and 90s so let me know down below what's the weather like where you are and what candles you are currently burning um here today it's like 60s it's nice and crisp um but it's not like cold or anything so it feels really great here lately so i can kind of do both spring and winter at the same time still so yeah i've been loving that but i'm really excited to start bringing that coconut cream pie candle and get into like spring and fall i mean spring and summer scents i keep saying fall spring and summer scents so yeah that's everything for today's video and i will see you all in the next one bye